First Mover Americas, FTX Faces Criminal Charges, the latest price moves in crypto markets in context for November 14, 2022. This article originally appeared in First Mover, Coindesk's daily newsletter putting the latest moves in crypto markets in context. Subscribe to get it in your inbox every day. Latest Prices Top Stories Bankrupt crypto exchange FTX faces a criminal investigation in the Bahamas following its dramatic collapse last week. Authorities in the Caribbean country where FTX has its headquarters are investigating whether any criminal misconduct occurred in the exchange's decline and bankruptcy. Sam Bankman Fried's crypto exchange went from being one of the world's largest to filing for bankruptcy in barely a week, after a Coindesk article raised questions about the financial stability of its sister company Alameda Research. The native token of Binance owned trust wallet soared 80% on Sunday after CEO Changpeng Zhao encouraged crypto users to take personal control of their digital assets. Zhao made the warning following the collapse of Binance's rival FTX, which Binance briefly agreed to rescue before aborting its plan after it took a closer look at FTX's balance sheet. Trust Wallet is a decentralized hot wallet facilitating the storage of cryptocurrencies. Its native token TWT allows holders to participate in decision-making related to the app's features. At the time of writing, TWT was up about 50% in the last 24 hours at $2.44, according to data by CoinMarketCap. Crypto.com CEO Chris Mershalek has attempted to assuage fears that the exchange could be the next to face a liquidity crisis. Crypto.com's native token CRO has dropped around 45% in the last week, while its daily volume was down to about $284 million in October compared with last year's highs of around $4 billion. In a YouTube interview, Mershalek reiterated that Crypto.com's balance sheet is strong and its exposure to FTT was limited. He added that CRO, unlike FTX's native token FTT, has never been used as loan collateral. This chart shows similarities between the current Bitcoin bear market and the 2018 market swoon. The latest decline is reminiscent of the November 2018 capitulation that saw Bitcoin drop nearly 50% to $3,200 precisely one year after the bull run peaked. Trending posts. After Bitcoin's worst week in five months, here's what crypto analysts are. Saying Democrats keep the US Senate but crypto only has eyes for FTX collapse all custodial crypto exchanges should adopt proof of reserve programs. But even that isn't enough. 